Okay, let's talk about the next entry. I'm gonna say so far, we I think we have very good entries for Germany's national selection. And um, let's talk about Leona and Andrimio. You know who she, who she reminds me of? Uh, the Swedish Hollywood, Hollywood reality housewife, Gunilla Persson's daughter, Erika. She remind, I thought it was her. I was like, Erika, what, what are you doing in Germany? But she has the same eyes and the hair and the jawline. She has the same eyes. I was like, who? Is this you? Anyway, I'll dream you by Le Leona. Sounds, sounds dramatic. A little bit Amy Darmy, that's one. It's been two thousand lonely hours. You're oh, a ballad. To talk about it's funny, cause we talked all of the time. I was in love with the feeling. Close my eyes and I still see you like you walk the hallways of my mind. Okay. I can't go on like this It's so hard to take And then I'm here alone away Oh, this is beautiful It wasn't even real somehow But I can't unfeel it I can't undream you now Oh Beautiful, beautiful you buy me yellow roses who believe it if they told us someday then I'll leave you and I Yeah roses that color have a meaning right underneath my pretty smile I'll be living in denial because I just can't believe this love be Can someone correct me? Doesn't the yellow roses stand for either friendship or forgiveness? Because red is love. I mean, every rose color has a different meaning. Isn't the uh, yellow roses either stands for forgiveness or friendship? There's something I don't know. I I'm not a big. I don't know about much about flowers, but I know that people tell usually um, a r flowers can mean something. I, no, I can't go on. Cause it's so hard to take that I'm here alone awake like it wasn't even real somehow. This is cute and gorgeous and I sad. See you in my sleep, that's the only way to keep you, keep your clothes and coming back around. I can't unfeel it, I can't undream. Mm -hmm. Now that I know what your kisses feel like How can I go back to living my life When all of the memories are playing in my head Over and over again Wow I mean, I gotta say, this was very beautiful, and I think when I was listening to it, I was like, this gives me Disney. This is a Disney sad ballad in the middle of a movie, or in a teenage movie something. This is a perfect movie score for some reason. She's gorgeous, and she sings so beautiful. But for a Eurovision entry, I doubt it because I think this song, well sure it depends on which songs you have before and after. I don't think this song stands out you know, when I would look into the other ones and then I look into the other ones in other countries. 
this is little this is beautiful but i think this song doesn't have that standout feeling i don't know i mean i'm gonna say it. it's a very pretty song it's very emotional she sings it beautifully and everything and i can't wait to see the live performance but i think this is a, a song that is very pretty very beautiful and everything i like it but i don't think this is a song to send because i think this song will be I think this is a song I will be looking at the Eurovision, Eurovision in May and be like, oh, she was here. I mean, I'm gonna have be a little bit like a talk by John Lundvig when I was watching uh, Eurovision back in 2019. I was like, I forgot he was here. I'm sorry, I, I thought about that four years ago. I think that is I'm afraid people will be here for her in Eurovision and she, she, I, she's, she sings it beautifully. Leona, you have a beautiful voice, you're a beautiful singer, but I think this song is not strong enough to stand out as a ballad. It's a very pretty song, but I think this is move, more a movie score ballad than a Eurovision entry. Still, I like it. So, it's a pretty song, so I wish you the best and I hope for great staging and live performance. Oh, my God.